very scary, very scary project, very scary picture. I'm not trying to call or signal anyone. If you do, I will kill your daughter, not because I want to, but because those are the rules. Daddy! Freaky Friday is a story of mothers and daughters. And uh, if you've ever been a, a mother or a daughter, uh, uh, and any combination of those two, I think you really understand what a what a what a difficult path that is. Life uh, in kind of the Disney house was uh, was kind of an interesting place. It was the old Disney. It's not the new Disney, you know. Everything's very cute, but it was slightly out of sync, you know. Don't forget, you know, Vietnam was happening, and there was. Uh, uh, a, a very political time in the United States, and uh, of course Disney didn't reflect that at all. But it was a great, fun place to be. His name is Ulysses Everett McGill, and he's on an odyssey, going through, he meets the sirens, he meets the cyclops. It's all about money, boys! Don't get it, Big Dan. Ah! Studios offered me a contract, and I chose Fox, and never really did anything with them. They loaned me out to do Darby O'Gill. So the first day I was there, I met Walt. All the Irish were in the place. Dennis O'Day, Albert Sharp was there. Jimmy O'Day, who used to drink uh, scotch and ginger ale. Jimmy was absolutely convinced that it was the ginger ale that destroyed your liver and not the, the scotch. <sighs> it drinks cool and easy, so it does. I have been called a difficult actor. People say, I get lost in the character. I don't think I'm difficult at all. I think I'm a, such a sweet guy to work with. Give us a kiss. <laughs> I thought I was wonderful, really.